yeah, uh, the big thing this week is uh, we got more Jack in the Box things. So if you haven't seen it already, we had like we made a reaction video to more uh, music video. We did, yeah. Uh, so we talked a lot about uh, like our first impressions, how we like reacted to it, like because we didn't like first reacted on the video because we couldn't con contain ourselves. No. Uh, it was, it would have been really hard to wait almost like a full week <laughs> for that video. Yeah. Uh, so bear with us. But uh, just as a recap, we loved it. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. It's such like, um, we talked about and just like, gave like a bunch of like uh, editing and camera work uh, little tips and tricks in there and it was really interesting sneakies. Sneakies. um <laughs> yeah I mean the the thing is is like it's such a departure from um uh hope world uh his first mixtape and I think that is what makes it not only just like fun but also really showcases his ability to transform um yeah into the duality we've talked about this yeah for a lot. the duality of j-hope is so interesting because i he's never shown us this side before and it's mm -hmm. such a departure from what we like we're know used him. to yeah like how we know him as an artist yeah. and i think that that's what makes it exciting and super fun to like be a part of his you know artist journey is it's also like almost nostalgic in a sense yeah for like for like <clears throat> me and like you because like this type of music this like punk rock vibe this is this is a lot of what like the type of music we grew up with yeah yeah like simple plan and green day and um you know imagine dragons even like yeah. park like this is all music that i am so accustomed to because it's like what i grew up on it's and almost like comfort it know? really is yeah like my dad is a huge like rock metal guy and so is my mm -hmm. brother so i grew up on a lot of like alt rock and like hard rock and metal music like that was my yeah there was a lot of rush basically. playing in my house growing up yeah like rush <laughs> and kiss and metallica motley mm -hmm. Crue, like all of these types of artists were readily available to me because like my dad is such a huge fan of that yeah. genre of music and so it kind of like brought back those feelings of it and i i just i love it it's so good <laughs> listen that bass and drum line i said it in the video oh. i don't know how many times but it's nasty and like in the best well, not just in possible. this video you just you've been repeating it since the video came out because it's true it's <laughs> no nasty and i'm here for it like i yeah that it's man so good like i it's so good it's just so good um I want to know like what your guys' thoughts are so like leave them yes in the comments below because i know in that the comments I... you can also like send us like messages on instagram or like yeah 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 twitter even yeah um give us your give us your thoughts and opinions on this this new j-hope that we're experiencing chapter because two baby chapter two, and i'm really excited on the 15th we're gonna get the rest of the the album jack in the box and yeah. I am so looking forward to seeing what this album is going to be, like how it's going to take shape, because he was mentioning, and we mentioned this too in our reaction, but like he mentioned that, um, actually Yoongi, I think was the one who pointed this out of like J-Hope a lot of the time does like a, like a, a line through the album that you can tell that all the songs yeah, like are connected together. Related, yeah. But um i'm excited to see if he'll keep that theme for this particular album or if he's going to depart from that and we're gonna get like different genres mixed together or if we're gonna get like different sounds mixed together if we're gonna get some like old school j-hope like what is gonna be the the sort of album design here also i don't know how many tracks are in this album either because i don't know either but i see i saw some speculation that there may be a namju feature <gasps> uh, don't quote me on this i would be excited about that it I mean, is speculation i mean of course that they're gonna like feature on each other's albums i think yeah. they had mentioned this like i mean if, it, we were talking if it's about true it. then great if it's not true then also great like, yeah like whatever it doesn't matter i'm also but... just like so in love with the artwork that we got from mm -hmm. this album it's so beautiful the concept 
the concept we got more because we got more concept photos we did too and it's so good (sighs) oh my god like last week like the black version yeah like was out this week that like when when he's wearing the white it's so good it's so and good. Me. And we also got the, the movie, the, like the MV sketch too. We did. Uh, which I haven't had the time to watch yet because I think it came out like very recently. Yeah. But yeah, uh, this like white fit is like sending me into a new dimension, <laughs> honestly. Like it's just so freaking good. Like, oh. Sorry. Man, he looks so good. I was like, what is this? Yeah. I love it. My baby. <laughs> Not anymore. <laughs> I, they're all my babies. And yet. <laughs> and yet. And yet. The only one I'm older than is JK. So, and that's by like five months. <laughs> I'm older than all of them except for Jin. Because we're the yeah. same age. Actually, I think I am older than him because my birthday is in June. Yeah, you so. are older than him. That's why I'm saying that the only one I'm older than is um, JK because I'm in February and he's in September. September. Yeah. So. Uh, but yeah, I, I absolutely love this song and I'm so freaking excited to see what the rest of this album is going to look like. I'm, I just can't wait. Like, can it come out now? <laughs> like, uh two weeks right uh yeah the 15th of july is when the entire yeah so yeah so in two weeks you're gonna get our full reaction because it comes out the day after uh next week's podcast yes so we gotta wait we gotta wait (laughs) but i yeah i'm very much looking forward to it also merch i don't know if we're getting merch or not i hope we are i mean now we got well (laughs) My wallet doesn't hope for that, but I hope for that. <laughs> Did you book your, your plane tickets, by the way? Yes, I have Good. my plane tickets to Chicago. Because <laughs> last time you did not. No, I have my plane tickets, yeah. Actually, I'm going um, this time instead of, because uh, like Calgary doesn't have direct flights um, to Chicago. Yeah. I would have to stop in uh, Pearson. Uh, and we've all okay. heard the news about Pearson being a disaster right now. So Yeah, no, you don't want that. No, so I'm actually flying out of Vancouver. So Lenny and I have the exact same flight. Oh, that's that's good. So at least <laughs> and we're going to be going sitting uh, with each other, actually, since we're leaving nice. at the same time. So I just so you're have basically to... flying over there to join her and then yes. leaving together. Nice. Yeah. I'm guessing you're going to do the same thing coming back. Uh, Yeah, yeah basically nice it'll be fun i'm excited like, uh, yeah boy we like and then and then tanya's gonna come out from like the other side <laughs> yeah well tanya and yancy are both coming from the east coast so it'll be a lot easier for them <laughs> i'm assuming that tanya will probably have a direct flight because uh yes uh, montreal be- yeah because montreal being an yeah, international airport yeah and i think so. yancy has the same so i'm excited for you guys it's gonna be so much fun. I, um, I need photos. Of course, there'll be lots of photos, <laughs> lots of videos. Obviously, like my in, the the our army think tank Instagram will be full of them. That will be the hub. That will be the be hub cry- of, and I will be crying in the corner. Information. Um, <laughs> I also like haven't decided what I'm gonna wear now because I had this like vision of what I was gonna wear because like Hope World, you know, I was gonna be like mm-hmm. colorful. And now that this album is out, I'm like, oh, okay, I have to rethink of what I'm going yep, to. Yep, you're gonna go wear. dark now. <laughs> I think I have an idea. Definitely want to go punk rock, but then we're seeing yeah. TXT too, so I'm trying to like. I mean, it kind of works. It kind of does, yeah. Because uh, Thursday's Child, the uh, it's very like punk yeah. rocky as well, so it kind of it fits together really nicely. <laughs> yeah, so you don't need to have like a thousand like pieces. No. <laughs> so it'll be interesting, especially since they're not the same night. Thank God they're not the same night. Yes, I know. Lucky for <laughs> that, that they're not at the same time. That would be uh, sad. I mean, yeah. But you get to see both, so. But we get to see both, so. Mm-hmm. And we'll get to see, like, some other artists. Um, I don't actually know who else is playing because I didn't bother to look. <laughs> hey, K-pop, you know? <laughs> it's it's about J-Hope and TXT and more yeah. specifically J-Hope, so. Yeah, I don't know.